action! Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, potato! <laughs> what? Hey, welcome to another day of Potato Princess. Today we're gonna make granola. And I have no idea how. I kind of wanted to do one with like nuts and seeds and a bunch of different things, but the only nuts I have are these whole walnuts, so I guess I will take the time to crack them. Uh, and then I'm gonna do more of like a plain version with just uh, maple syrup and cinnamon. I started with a cup of rolled oats, and then I added five fresh walnuts. Hard to do this with one hand. Oh! <laughs> oh shit! That didn't work out very well. <laughs> and I have walnut shells everywhere, so I'll be finding them for days, I'm sure. And I've preheated my oven to 350 degrees. So I'll start with a quarter of a cup. And I think it's gonna need another one. Okay, so I've got a half a cup in with my cup of rolled oats and my five fresh walnuts. And then I've got these sweet vanilla cream drops. And I thought that would give my granola some really cool flavor, so I'm putting about four drops in there. Uh, I'm gonna mix it right away so it doesn't saturate into one place. Oh my gosh. Oh, that smells so good. A few dashes of cinnamon. I'm just gonna spread this out on a cookie sheet with parchment paper, that way it won't and I'm going to slide it off into the container I'm going to store it in. So I'm doing this only on half because on my other half I'm going to do a lower fat nut free version. So I'll put that out on this half. Okay, so the granola is out of the oven. I did it for 10 minutes, and then another 10 minutes, and then I did I flipped it, because I realized I should have done that, and did another five minutes. Uh, if I spaced it out more, it would probably get crispier. So I'll do that next time. But I think it's, ow, it's super hot still. I'm gonna give it a try. Oh my god, that's so good, it's like candy. <laughs> Stop finishing the roller. Yeah, okay. 